by visualizing what I want. I want a new place. I want it to have a nice yard to sit in. I want to have a one bedroom, one bath. I don't think a studio is big enough. I want a garage. I want close to work. I want. So that's the process of manifesting. You get an idea of what you want, mm -hmm. and then you say, sure, I can have this. Why shouldn't I have this? And you can even fill in richer detail if you want, and then let it go. Mm -hmm. At what so? At what point does that become obsessive? Yeah, that's one way to do it, right? Mm -hmm. That's kind of the common way. That's the vision board way, right? Right. We'll call that the vision board way. Mm -hmm. You could also do it the, the Elohim and the Council way. Oh, fun! What's that? <laughs> the Elohim and the Council way is to clear static, so then all possibilities are yours. And how do you clear static around that? Just well, the, you did a really, you really good job with the I re realizing that you're trying to rent it as a 14 year old instead of as a whatever year old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a real big static clear. Because mm -hmm. all of a sudden, let's say, just using your example, you have the mindset of a 14 year old. Then you have static between you and anything that wouldn't settle good for a 14 year old. Right. So, which is basically like a cardboard box or, you know, living in somebody's <laughs> actually, car in their I driveway. Always, actually, I know it's always happened in really cool little <laughs> cabins, either at the beach or in the mountains. So, when you. Think about the circle of possibilities tool, right? These are all housing options on the outside of the circle. And here's okay. you in the middle. And in between those two is all the static that you've generated throughout your life. Preconceived notions, life's proven it to you, you've been taught limitation, you feel limitation because you're a financial or physical picture, right? whatever. Some of it is easier to clear than others. Like you realize the 14-year-old thing, that cleared that one, yay. So what we like to do with people is to say, okay, ima not imagine so much the details in a vision board way, but imagine the sense of having a place that you feel comfortable living in. Mm -hmm. Just as a general statement. Mm -hmm. I have a place I feel comfortable living in. Mm -hmm. And see what comes up in you. Well, there's no way I could afford it. Well, there's mm -hmm. no way it could be close to work because that neighborhood's expensive. Or there's no, just really what up. stories come up. Yeah. You know, what stories come up. And for you, some of your stories were around letting go of the old place. Mm -hmm. Was generating static toward getting the new place. Mm -hmm. You see? Yeah. So static can be anything. And it's up to you to sort of data mine the static field to figure out what's really the big blocks. Because you don't have to get rid of every single little piece of static for op um, possibilities to come close to you. But you need to get rid of big chunks of them. Can you feel that? I certainly can. So it's not like every single, you can't be like, I'm never going to have a house because there's no way I can clear all my static. Well, the system's not set up to screw you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and you already managed to have homes. Every single one of you, as far as we know, has a place to live. Then you have lots of static. So see, yeah. it worked, the, it worked I've, once. I've now invested <laughs> some beauties. You know, my friends yeah. always go, why don't you find the coolest place to yeah. live? So you can do the vision board way. And like you said, you know, when, you, when you're just like, it needs a bay window, it needs a bay window, it needs a bay window. Oh, yeah. It's a little crazy. Yeah. Uh, well, but we, stay in your preferences. Like, you know, really like a yard. Yeah, it's really too small. Well, this, this, okay, so let's pick that. I'd really like a yard. And then, but then I'd have to mow it. Or maybe the water bill would be too high. Or that the next door neighbor. Yeah. Okay, so this example is a what? Right. That's all static. Yeah. So I'd really like a yard. That's manageable. What comes up? That's manageable. So then you've got the old yard wasn't manageable. So then definition of manageable needs to be looked at. Mm -hmm. So yeah. rather than like have a, have a clipping out of a magazine of a beautiful yard that you think is manageable, which is the vision board way, mm -hmm. we'd rather you go, yeah, that'd be an interesting yard. What comes up in me around the idea of ah. caring for that yard? Ding, 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 ding. Like, okay. wow, I really love those flowers. I bet they would need, you know, like watering a lot or... I really love those flowers. I wonder if that would stir up my hay fever. Or I really love those flowers. I wonder if the neighborhood cats would pee on them. Like whatever comes up. Mm -hmm. That's your static. And everybody's got their own version of it. Right? Yeah. You've got your own version of what makes static for you. And, and sometimes what we really love about this is you can laugh at your static. Try to laugh at it, mm -hmm. because then it completely disempowers it, right? It's like that, what do you have that Harry Potter show, and that big scary thing would come out, and they would make funny jokes, and mm -hmm. it would go away. Mm -hmm. Good, actually, really, really good example. So when your static comes up, and you imagine yourself, you know, having a house, and or like you're driving down the road, and you see it for rent, and you see a house, and you say, wow, I really like this location, 
and we'll pick something that comes up for Veronica. It has a lot of stairs in the front. She'd be like, oh, it'd be really hard to carry things up those stairs all the time. Okay, so that can be one of two things. It's either static because your preconceived notion, or it can be just the truth. Yeah. Right? It can yeah. just be the truth. That's out because I don't want to carry groceries up those stairs for the next decade. Yeah. It just ain't going to happen. Yep. Yeah. But if instead you said something like, ooh, that's a cute house. Maybe I should grab it or try to get it. And you ignore the fact that the stairs bug you. Mm -hmm. Static. Uh -huh. we, need like, we need like a little visual that static comes out of it. Static generation. So you just tell your truth. You just tell your truth. That's my truth. My yeah. truth is, I have stairs not so much. Yeah. Not so much. Yeah. So that's, we've talked a lot, not recently, but in the past few weeks or months or so, we've talked a lot about static and how really that's, you know, that's the step we're on. You know that, right? Static's kind of your direction. It's kind of your direction too, doesn't it? It's like, mm. when you see, like when I see static, I'm like, oh, that's the way I don't want to go. Because there's static there, and I kind of want to go this way, away from the static. That's not how we use static. That's how we use static really is the circle. Of all the possibilities are out here. You're in the middle. The only thing, and we between mean the only me thing, between you and the possibilities being choices. Okay? The only thing between you and all these possibilities becoming choices, as in I get to choose between house A and house B, because I'm in an abundant universe, and house C. Let's throw in another one. The only thing that stops those from being legitimate choices is the static you have generated or brought with you. We, you know, we kind of call it baggage too, but anyway, let's just stick with mm -hmm, static. Mm -hmm. The static that is generated by the idea of having those things. Perfect. I get it. Yay! Get it. And that's perfect because... And that's that's, a, that's a new way because I've been doing the old manifesting and stuff the old way. Mm -hmm. So thank you for both those answers. Yeah. It's just like I feel... <sighs> <sighs> <Okay>. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, so uh, we're going to have the rest of the council come because 